let's get down to business. Total fate behind. Did they send me daughters when I asked for sons? Hey guys, it's Liz. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are talking about the Lust brand or the Love Yourself brand. And yeah, we're going to be trying out some of their products. So Lus was founded by a woman named Sapar. She is a woman of color and an immigrant. And she basically founded this brand because she wanted people or anyone to rock their natural hair and feel beautiful and unique. And yeah, she didn't want people to have to straighten their hair to feel beautiful. So they it comes with a shampoo and conditioner and then a... The number three step is their all-in-one styling product. And basically it's just, like it's one product, that's all you need. So me being a lazy curly girl, I really enjoy that because if I don't have to use three different products to get my hair to get good results, I won't. I ain't got time for that. So I do use the Kinky Coily one. They have wavy, curly, and kinky coily. I use the kinky coily one, and I have used it for a couple months, and I really enjoy it. So I thought I should use, try it out, and use the curly one on one side of my head, kinky coily one on the other side of my head, just to see if there is any difference, how it lasts, and yeah, all that. So if you're interested in seeing this video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe down below, and let's get into it. So I wet my hair, and I parted it down the middle, and I am basically, I think I'm going to do the curly side on this side and the kinky coily on that side. Let's see how it goes. So, tuck this side away. So this could get a little messy because I am pretty messy with my hair products. So for this product, you want to use a lot of water because it is water activated. So just remember a lot of water, a little bit of product. Otherwise, your hair is going to be weighed down and it won't look as good. Just really soak the product. too much. Okay, just want to rub it and pass it through. Really make sure you get all the strands. So this isn't like it kind of kind it kind of feels like a gel consistency. And I don't quite remember what the kinky coily one felt like. I haven't used it in a while, so I think it's a little thicker. Yeah. I really like this brand because on their website they talk about like it says like LUS love yourself so every morning you can wake up and you can look at the bottle and remember that everyone has flaws and everyone's going through different parts in their lives and just love yourself. So that's just like a really good message to portray. So I'm just going to fast forward and do this side of my head with a curly and I'll be back when we do that side.
So I'm done with the curly side and these are the results. Yeah. Let's go to the kinky coily side now. off my brush so I didn't have any product from the curly side okay so this product is a lot thicker than the curly one and so I'll probably like that better I'm just going to repeat what I did on this side. Okay, so this is with both sides done and I am just going to take my microfiber towel and just kind of squish out some any excess product. Just going to show you the back. Honestly, you can't really tell a difference in sides right now. This side, the curly side, is a little bit more frizzy, but yeah, just because it's probably because it's not as thick as the kinky coily side. So that's okay though. Here's the kinky coily. And the curly. So I'm gonna air dry for until it's like 80% dry and then I will diffuse and I'll be back when it's fully dry. So I'm back. It's been around four hours and I air dried it and diffused it. And this is the kinky coily side with no picking or fluffing. And this is the curly side with no picking or fluffing. So the kinky coily side is more defined and it does have kind of a cast on it, which that's pretty good. And the curly side is softer and fluffier, but it does have more frizz. So I honestly don't mind either side. It's just I think that the kinky coily side will last longer for me during the week than the curly side. So I'm just gonna separate the curls and yeah, see how it looks. So since the hair, the curly side is a little bit more frizzier, I don't really want to pick at them or separate them too much. So I'm just running my hands through my hair like that. Look at the back. 
so I picked it out and fluffed it and this is what it looks like kinky coily side and the curly side okay so it's the next day and this is how I wear my hair to bed and I'm just gonna take it down it's just like a silk scarf wrapped around the hair just so you can see the results the next day So this is the kinky coily side and this is the curly side. As you can tell, the curly side does have a lot more frizz than the kinky coily side, which yeah, we all knew that was going to happen. We all knew that was going to happen. My hair is a frizzy mess, so yum. I just wanted to show you guys the next day how it was. It was pretty humid yesterday, so that's probably why this side is a little bit more frizzy. And yeah, so yeah. Honestly, um, if you have hair like mine, that likes a bit of a thicker consistency, I say go with the kinky coily, but if you like the soft, fluffy, like, volumized hair go with the curly uh yeah i'm going to use both of them i still like both of their products even though the curly is not that thick i will still use them both because they are good products and i love this brand if you liked what you see today please give a thumbs up subscribe to my channel you can find my instagram down below i will be doing some more like little instagram videos on there so check that out and yeah thank you so much um for everyone who subscribed i will eventually be doing like a curly hair giveaway but i just want to get to like more followers before i do that thanks bye